the experience of, of having a premature baby, it's, it's scary because you don't know if he's gonna stay with us. When he came out, he yelled, he screamed, and it was great when I heard him, like, rah, like, oh, he's, he's good, I heard him. But then he, he stopped. We had to do CPR on him for 21 yeah, they, minutes and yeah, he's going to get him to breathe. It seemed like it was a long it seemed forever, time. Yeah. It seemed forever that they would give him CPR. It looked scary because I didn't know really what was going to happen after that. I started thinking bad thoughts about what's going to happen to him later on into the future. So I was really scared. But there was a lot of good, good um, nurses and doctors around us. So I knew it would be okay. He was the size of an elf in a shell. That was the, we took a picture of him, right? Mm -hmm. We took a picture of him with the elf in a shell, and he was the same size as an elf in a shell. My goodness. It was scary, but I knew he was gonna be fine. And then the next morning, they told me, oh, are you ready to hold him? And I was like, what do you mean? He's only like three days old. I was expecting to hold him when he was like a month bigger. Mm -hmm. And they said, no, you're ready, so they, they told us to hold him, so it was very scary because I felt like he was going to break when it was going to get him out of there or if he was going to stop breathing. Oh, and when I grabbed him, I could see him like coming closer to me. I felt like I was going to pass out. It was just very scary. When I hold him, I felt like this warmth and it was, I don't know, it's too many emotions together, I guess you could say. But it was awesome, it was great. They told me that it was gonna help the baby to feel me close to him because he's so used to being inside me. So that they wanted him to hear my heartbeat like when he's in the womb. That it will help him develop better and feel safer. So that's what we did, we grabbed him. And like I said, it was very scary, but yeah, I, think I think it, it did work. work. It did work I a think lot. It did work a lot. It made the baby feel safe and I felt safer too. Yeah, because one thing is to have them in the incubator and not get, if they're not getting hold, I mean, if I was the baby, I would love to get hold. <laughs> when she did it, I saw everything came out fine. I was like, ooh, I want to do that too. But I didn't, I didn't ask. And then they, the, then the nurse asked me, huh? they're like, you want to do it too? And I was like, yes, I do. That was great. And once I grabbed him, he he liked it. He he didn't fuss about it. That feeling right there is it's nice, great. Then I didn't wanna let her do it anymore. And yeah, I was, I was stealing from I me. was ready to do it all the time. <laughs> what was the feeling on you? Uh, when I when I was told that I was gonna be able to do it, I was. Very, very scared because I felt the same way my mom felt that I was gonna break over something. So I kept telling my mom that I didn't want to do it because I felt like that. And then I had to, I had to do it, so then I did it, and I felt good after that. So ever since that happened, I've been holding him after that. They got to the point that he was never in the incubator, only like I don't know at nighttime. I would get that, we'll hold him three hours, and then dad will hold him, and then the brother will hold him, and then he will go, we will rotate so he was out of the time. Yeah, he was never and in the they kept telling us that it was fine as long as every, all his um, his temperature and everything is fine, that it was fine yeah. with them. So he was always whole, and now that's all he wants. He's having his welcome home party. We waited. Well, a little longer so he could be better and bigger because I didn't want him to get sick or... He was going to have a baby shower that he never had because uh, he kind of um, came out too soon. So all, all, a lot of our family hasn't seen him. So that's what the part is for. Just, just yeah. people come see him. He is four months. He's going to be five months on the 18. He's doing great. He gets bigger every day. He loves to be hold. Can't leave him down. <laughs> if I lay him down, he starts crying and yeah, he wants to be picked up. He doesn't like it when we let him go. 